Hello everyone, hello chief friends, it's Mommy Ryan here. If you are new to this channel, welcome. How are you all guys? I hope you are doing great. Today I'm gonna be showing you my kind of a sad plant. This is my red Siam Aurora or they simply call this one the red Siam. As you can see, the plant shows legginess. So this legginess, they use this term for a process known as etiolation. Welcome to Life with a G Fam! Now, etiolation means the plant is unhealthy. The stems tend to grow longer than natural due to some reasons. So one of the many reasons is about the pot. They said the pot is too small and the roots are visible outside the soil. But in this case, I don't think the pot is small and I don't see any roots visible outside the soil. And the second one is improper lighting. Well, this plant is situated near the glass door and it's in the east side of the house. So definitely it's receiving a morning sunlight and about two to three hours, I think, it's being given a bright light situation. So I don't think it's improper lighting. And the third one is they said too much fertilizer that is high in nitrogen because this tends to make the plant grow faster and longer maybe the reason is the third one but anyways we gotta have to do a solution for this they said you gotta they said you have to repot but i don't think i need to repot this one and the next option would be pruning so as you can see, some of the stems here were already cut off. They were accident they were they were accidentally cut off by my kids. And so we have to finish the other stems. And it's a good thing when you cut off these stems, they're just going to grow. This is just one way of of propagating aglonema. You just have to cut it where as long as you can see the nodes and then you just have to put it in the water and wait for for a few weeks as for my case it's been like three weeks before i saw um before i saw some roots coming out but it's fine as long as it it survived in pruning you have to cut stems down to two to three inches above the soil and that would encourage rejuvenation and healthy growth. So let's do this guys. Let's start pruning. And we're done pruning. All you have to do is put all those cut-off stems in a jar of water or a glass of water. And this is one way of actually propagating. Just like what I have here, these are the cut-off stems that were accidentally cut by my kids. And as you can see, there are already um, roots growing here. So yeah, I'm going to update you guys maybe after a month of how this plants cope up. So we'll see if there are new, new leaves coming out from those stems that are here in the soil. 
thank you for watching everyone if you are new to this channel please do like this video and do not forget to subscribe and turn on the bell for notifications thanks again for watching we'll see you in the next one so stay safe and make good choices bye everyone